I'm Frank, the Low Carb Cocktail Guy. Today I'm going to show you my spin on the margarita. This is the cocktail that got me started with low carb cocktails. My wife loves margaritas and for the longest time she was using the Jose Cuervo zero calorie bottle mix. And I thought to myself there's got to be a way to make a better cocktail that's low carb without using a mix. So I did a lot of research um, online, did a lot of, watched a lot of videos, read a lot of blogs uh, about low carbs and exactly what makes a good margarita. And as we all know, a margarita is just um, tequila, lime juice, and triple sec. Well, we don't use triple sec because all the cores are just loaded with sugars and just have ungodly amounts of carbs in them. So what we did is instead of the triple sec, for a sweetener, we use a Splenda Serum. And to get that orange little bite from it, um, we ended up using orange bitters. Uh, we wanted to try something different. Um, we also do a recipe with this where we use a quarter teaspoon of orange extract instead of the bitters, so that's an option also. But this one, uh, we really liked how it came out with the orange bitters. So this is what we're going to make today. So we're going to start off in our mixing glass. We're going to get two ounces of tequila. We'll be using uh, El Jimador Blanco today. So what we're going to be doing is going one ounce and two ounces in our mixing glass. Then my Splenda syrup, which is one part Splenda, one part water, um, until it's dissolved. Um, you might want to warm it, but you definitely don't need to boil it like a regular simple syrup. Uh, I use the baking Splenda. Um, it dissolves really quick, so there's no need for the boiling and all that stuff. You just want it dissolved. So we're going to go with three quarter ounce of simple syrup. And we will be using some fresh limes today. Now, I mentioned in a couple of other videos, we'll talk about lime juice, is that uh, fresh limes have about two and a half carbs um, per ounce of lime juice. If you want to go ahead and do a no carb, like my wife does, she tries to get as little carbs as she can, um, she uses the uh, bottled concentrated lime juice. You know, it doesn't taste as good, it really doesn't, but um, if you want a no carb cocktail, that's the way to go. So when I fix her, her margarita, uh, there's zero carbs in it. For myself, I do like the, the, the flavor that fresh lime juice is going to add. And that might be enough. Let's take a look and see. So we just need about three quarters of an ounce. And perfect. So from here, we're going to add that orange. Like I said, we're going to be using Angostura's orange bitters. Um, Went back and forth with two dashes, three dashes, up to ten dashes. That was a bit much. But I found a happy medium that I like with, it's a lot, six dashes of Angostura bitters. And that's it. So from here, we're going to go ahead and fill our shaker with ice. Go ahead and pour it on margarita. And give it a good shake. And I do mine on the rocks. I've had the glass chilling with a little bit of ice in it. Just pour that in there. Garnish it. My wife really doesn't have the patience to wait for a garnish, but we'll go ahead and do a line wedge on a garnish. And there you go. The low carb margarita. Mmm, that's delicious. A little tank of the orange bitter. 
little bite because we're using bitter. Um, great, great cocktail. Go ahead and try this cocktail out. Leave a comment. Let me know what you think. Remember, drink responsibly, enjoy, and have a great night. Mm, that's good stuff.